Vegas, the most popular cities is Dallas. And proud Texans will tell you that growing even faster than the Dallas skyline is the city's reputation for big-time sports. Whirling controversy still surrounds the Dallas Cowboys, but the fact remains, Dallas is the big D. And tonight, on FNN Score, the biggest indoor tennis tournament of the year comes here to Dallas. It's the 19th annual Buick World Championship Tennis Finals. Tonight's matches are brought to you by Buick and your Buick dealer. The Great American Road belongs to Buick. And by Acer Technologies, bringing you outstanding computer products for over 12 years. And by Avia, the one line of athletic shoes really designed and engineered for athletic use only. Tonight, the WCT Finals kick off on score with an American original, John McEnroe, the only four-time winner at Dallas. McEnroe recently turned 30, but he's playing with the same vigor that once made him the number one player in the world. Making his first appearance at the WCT is the heir apparent to McEnroe's throne, Andre Agassi, the 18-year-old teen dream who's caught the imagination of tennis fans everywhere. Agassi and McEnroe, tonight on score. This is Reunion Arena in Dallas, Texas, for 10 years, home to World Championship Tennis. Tonight's score presents WCT Finals quarterfinal action. And good evening, everybody. I'm John Losing. Welcome to the first of three nights of coverage of the WCT Finals here from Dallas. We have a great field for you, and we look forward uh, to your taking part with us. It's an excellent field, and I'm joined by Dennis Ralston. Dennis, one of the handsome eight, that original group of pioneers that uh, started off WCT play back in 1968. And Dennis, let's begin with a feature match tonight. Andre Agassi and John McEnroe. Andre Agassi coming off a great 1988, but looking for his first win of 1989. Well, he certainly had a great year last year, but uh, this year so far not been able to win, so tonight a real test against McEnroe. It's a battle of the top two Americans right now, Agassi against McEnroe. Agassi is number four, McEnroe's number six. It's developed into quite a rivalry, and John McEnroe, I think, no longer has to answer the question, is McEnroe back? He is, and he's playing great tennis. McEnroe's played great tennis the last six months. He's moving up the ladder, sights set on number one, and I think he's going to get there. Well, it is an excellent field. In fact, seven of the top the ten players in the world are here. It is perhaps the best field in Dallas history. Now, let's take a look at the rankings and the players who are here, beginning with Yvonne Lendl, the top seed, followed by Mats Vilander, the number two seed, who won three Grand Slams last year. Edberg is here. Becker was supposed to be here, but he fell ill and had to withdraw. Jakob Lasek, playing as well as anybody indoors last year, comes to Dallas for the first time. And there's Andre Agassi. We'll see him tonight again. John McEnroe, two of the top Americans. Pernforce also playing. He's ranked number 19. And we take a look at some more of the top players in the world. And on down the list, you'll see Brad Gilbert at number 16. So Gilbert comes in as an alternate. Gilbert taking the place of Boris Becker. So an excellent field coming to Dallas, and let's take a look at the bracketing to show you what has happened so far in quarterfinal play. Of course, it is a field of eight, and already uh, we've seen Brad Gilbert with a victory, a surprising victory last night as he knocks off Stefan Edberg. Uh, but we look forward to our match tonight. It'll be Andre Agassi and John McEnroe, the new against the old. And the winner there to play the winner of Avon Lindel and Jakob Lasek. Lindel is the top seed. So we'll be back with McEnroe Agassi quarterfinal action here from Dallas right after these messages.